In other news tonight, the Pulaski County Jail is set to take center stage on Netflix. And some county officials are not too happy about that. Channel 7's Brenda Lipinski is on your side. She spoke with both the county judge and the county sheriff today. Brenda, they filmed inside the jail over six weeks. Yes, Chris, and this series was filmed last year. Now, according to a synopsis, it's a jail experiment in which they unlocked a unit of filled with felons, stripped away authority, author, the authority of deputies, and they entrusted the detainees to run themselves. When you saw the trailer, what were your immediate thoughts? What the heck? Where, where did this come from? A shocked response from Pulaski County Judge Barry Hyde after finding out last Thursday the Pulaski County Jail and its inmates were the subject of an upcoming Netflix series. It's uh, created quite a stir. Um, I'm hearing from folks all over the county, from every aspect of the county. Flooded by concerns from organizations and officials over how this could make the county look. The comment I get over and over again is, oh my God, this is going to be like gangbanging in Little Rock. It's terrible for us. Among other things. Worry of liabilities um, that may have been created uh, while this was going on in the jail. We spoke with Pulaski County Sheriff Eric Higgins, who says he was approached by Lucky 8 TV Inc. in 2021 about doing the series and turned to the county attorney for legal advice. And, and the question was, do I have the authority to allow a camera crew to come into the facility? And the answer was yes, that as a sheriff, you run the jail, you control who goes in and out of that jail. And if you want to have them come in, you can do that. Is there a particular reason why you didn't let the county judge know that this was taking place? Well, um, nothing against the county judge. I mean, I wasn't trying to keep it from him. And so I want to make that clear. I wasn't trying to hide something from him. I'm just operating uh, as, as uh, an elected official as a sheriff over the county uh, sheriff's office in the county jail, I was moving forward. No different than the reentry program. I didn't go to the county judge and, and tell him, I want to do this. Higgins says he had good intentions in entering the agreement. One of the things we're looking at is can we convert this facility to an indirect supervision? I'm not looking at just doing something just to do it. How can I use what we learn? to improve the facility, make it safer for the deputies, make it safer for the detainees in this facility. Under the agreement, Lucky 8 TV Inc. agreeing to pay $1,000 a day to film. Sheriff Hagen standing by his decision, saying they learned a lot through the filming. But anything you do when you're trying to improve uh, or do something different, you're going to have pushback. But at the end of the day, I think you're going to see that it works. Now, Sheriff Higgins says the county should be receiving the check next week, and it'll go into a general fund for the county. On your side, I'm Brenda Lipinski. Okay, Brenda, thanks so much. That new series, by the way, will debut on Netflix April 10th.